I saw you on the drive, round wavy hair under knit hat and vintage camera. Why ask me for directions? I'm lost too. But if you give me your crescent moon smiles, I will find my way to your tangerine beauty through telescopes of coffee cups. So when we part with a simple wave, no phone numbers exchanged, I'm left watching you walk away for days until the crescent moon waves to nothing. Life returns to alleyways of ordinary. Bus rides of the mundane. A flash of hope dissipates and I will be the same. But I won't. I won't forget you, so come. Be my lighthouse, the candle on my cake. Light up the night sky so I won't stumble in this alley anymore. And you'll be there, waiting, past, and you'll be there, waiting, past the dumpsters full of Cracker Jack prizes I bought to give myself worth. At the end of it, like a shaking space, leprechaun of serendipity in a cathedral of mirrors we built to find our own divinity. You will be at the altar, giving up all the have-beens and yesterdays for the sacrament of now. And I will save you with my trembling kazoo mouth. We'll go slow. Because just looking at you is a sin. And your skin is a foreign language I am only starting to begin. So teach me the word for the freckle above your eyebrow, the scar on your finger. But you don't need to tell me your history. I can see. Too many men have used you as their needle to inject drugs of fear and control, to make themselves feel tall, tossed you into the haystack to make you feel small. So I wasn't expecting to find you here, poking a hole into my empty coffee can skin to let the light in. You made me the perfect pinhole camera. So take me with you on your travels. Let my heart be your camera. My aortic valve, its shutter. Opening and closing, pumping and pushing, taking snapshots of time so we will remember we were alive. So when the locals ask why you have a coffee can on a string around your neck, why your personality is so fragile yet sharp, tell them it is to let the light in. <laughs>